everyone. Okay. Uh, today, um, this isn't going to be the main thing we do, but I will be damned if I do not finish this damn tree. I now have so much extra wood. I have so much. I'm, I ain't running out of wood anytime soon. Well, I mean, I might soon, but if I do, then I'm just going to go farm more because we have so much wood now. Uh, yeah, it, I'm just going to finish the tree. I'm just going to do it. And, like, I don't even care. Like, before, I would, like, try and conserve wood in the in the edges and stuff. Like, I don't even care. Dude, I, like, I can make, I can make this stuff. No one makes this stuff. This stuff looks cool, but no one does it because it's, it's so, it's so expensive. You, you're wasting wood. But I'm going to do it because why wouldn't I do it? It's just, like, I've got so much extra wood. Oh, it's so, it's so good. This tree farm is now, like, going to be a thing that I make on every single like every single world that I have like in the future I'm going to make this tree farm because I gotta I just have to it's so good um figure I uh, do this. I'm probably actually going to go through like a lot of wood here, but that's all right. That's all right. All right. All right. Um, not great at doing trees in this game, especially like trees in this way, but not terrible and I can like sculpt around the tree like okay this side is pretty bad but I want to make it more three-dimensional oh wow bam now all of a sudden that side doesn't look nearly as bad oh this side looks stupid oh well, well all what I got to do is just bam 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 as before like this would be so difficult to do because I I'd run out of wood, and I'd be like, oh, man, I don't want to farm more wood. What's, what's a pain in the butt to make, uh, to get? Well, it isn't anymore. <laughs> you're, you're just going to see me, like, gloat about this for, like, ever. Also, this is probably going to annoy people, but, like, the tree is slightly slanted to this side. <sighs> oh, well. I don't know. I, I don't really mind that the tree is a little slanted. But... I know some people might not like that. Um, one second. I'll be right back. Okay, so uh, starting to starting to go on this thing here. Ooh, almost messed that up. Uh, whoa, that's actually kind of cool. Uh, I'm starting to go on this. Um, this is gonna look a little wonky, and it's probably gonna take a little while for me to actually get a, uh, a style for this that I want to do um, but what I want to do is just make a tree here in the middle and no, maybe I want to go up um, Um, I really like giant trees in this game. Uh, big fans, and I really like the idea of a giant tree coming out, and then on the ceiling, doing, uh, like a big, big leaves and stuff. Is that floating? No, it's not big uh like a leaving out the ceiling and stuff like that it makes a makes a room look really cool uh if you're not sure what i'm gonna be doing this episode i'm with the new found wood we have gotten last episode the, a big reason i have not been decorating this base in the, the way that i have been is because of the wood the wood issue now with a lot of these hallways 
like uh, like down here like down here for instance okay if I were to do this in the same way that I've been doing it normally so like this this wall design gets boring so what you want to do is put something in it okay I will probably do this as I have like almost no wood left so what we could do is I don't know like every five so on, on the sixth one we put a wood post and then we put the leaves background into it and then we can decorate around it and then you know if we want to put a design into the ceiling and do stuff like that I don't know maybe you want to put like a piece of glowstone in there so we don't need the torches anymore if I want to do that okay the leaves are expensive well the leaves aren't that expensive they're, e they're way easier to get as I can get a few stacks in like a few minutes but I, I don't have the, you don't have the same luxury you really don't when it comes to uh, the wood so now that we have the wood I can actually kind of grind out for it a little bit and like I've been using wood like all silly willy-nilly and whatnot and I still have so much wood so uh, this episode is going to be dedicated specifically to just just making corridors look good I want this base to be shining to be shining bright and like I want to uh I want to maybe finish down here a little bit and really go in and decorate so yeah it's gonna be a Hey, I'm going to be doing this cut, this cut, this cut, and uh, we're going to be beautifying this base up uh, to a degree that I've been wanting to do for a while. So yeah, I'll be back in a moment when I'm done with this tree. Okay, I've, I've finally finished this. Okay, <laughs> this took forever. This took like literally forever. Oh, there's still some I missed. Um, this might not look the greatest, and uh, you might think that these are randomly placed, in which they are. Um, and probably over the course of the next while, I'm going to be just com coming in and placing these. But I'm very, very happy with how this is. And I almost used all the leaves as well. I used so many leaves. But I'm finally in a point where I'm kind of like, okay, this isn't bad. This is not bad. Um, this was like the one, I think this was like the most sore, like eyesore unfinished thing I had. And I finally finished it. So yeah, I, like I've done enough work on this thing to where like, it feels like I should just be done with, uh, this episode, but, uh, I've barely started this episode. Ugh. Oh shoot, I almost overshot that. Um, so yeah, I'm definitely gonna need to get more leaves. And uh, it's one thing I really realizing now I'm missing in this base is a dedicated area to do the, uh, to, to do my uh, tree farming. See on, if you remember that uh, the world tour for that old world I did, or for the uh, my old world um, I had a big big room uh, that I did a lot of my redstone in like extra redstone that like I wanted to test and where I did a lot of tree farming I do intend on making that again I'm not really sure when or where I'm gonna make that but I really want to And, uh, but uh, I, I do know I want to make it. Also, I don't think I've ever pointed it out. Uh, this tree farm uh, just runs through bone meal. I've, like, I'm almost, like, picked clean of all of the bone meal I have inside of the, uh, the farm. So I'm going to need to do, uh, I'm going to need to, like, double time on a lot of my collecting. Um, I flew out of there so fast I became lost. I did, did not know where I was. Um, but yeah, I'm uh, I'm very happy with where this uh, this tree is at now, and I think I'm ready to uh, to move on to the next 
area I want to start uh, sprucing up. That being down here. Yes, this area is big open. Uh, initially, this was supposed to be a, uh, a big room where I, uh, where the, the villagers were supposed to reside. But as I started putting villagers in here, I put like a villager here, 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 I kind of like took a step back and realized, wow, this looks awful. <laughs> so I uh, moved the villagers to the villager area, which uh, I still gotta keep going on this one too. Yeah, I moved the villagers to the villager area and uh, got left with this. This room does not serve a purpose, so we're just gonna flat out make it not serve a purpose. This room is going to uh, just be purely for decoration. It's just gonna be a room that connects other rooms. As I kind of view this room as like the hub. This room connects off to all my main areas of the villager, of the main area, like the big tree, and then into the farming district. But this room itself doesn't look good. So I think it's time I, uh, I made it look a little better. So yeah, I'm going to start trying to, um, yeah, I'm going to start trying to put some stuff in here and hopefully spruce it up to a, uh, a much better place because it's not great currently. So, uh, yeah, I'll be back in a bit. Okay, I've, uh, kind of finished this section. Kind of. Um. This section is looking pretty good. Uh, there's maybe some changes I want to make, or some, uh, also stuff like I put these ledges here I want to maybe put some flower pots on them but I'm, I'm I don't really have the flowers or don't really know what I specifically want to do with them um, like I have roses and stuff um, and uh, I'd also really like for more vines to grow I want to get this like super viney um, but yeah I've got it and uh, the roof I'm actually a pretty big fan of the roof uh, I like the uh, sort of spiral outwards design of that. Um, how it kind of comes up a little bit. I was going to do it leaves originally, but I opted to do wood instead because uh, I had more. <laughs> and I thought like green floor, green wall, green roof, eh, a little too green. So I figure it's probably all right. But yeah. With, uh, with this section done, um, I would like to start moving on to maybe another section. Um, I also have this upper area that like I haven't done much with, and uh, I'm, not the, I'm not the biggest fan of how... This area feels like claustrophobic to me. I don't know. I kind of want to figure out a way to open it up a little more. Um, but yeah, so the stuff I want to work on next is actually over here. Uh, right here, I have a perfect opportunity to make a little staircase going up and, uh, connecting it up to here, make a little connection port. And then I have, uh, I have room to make more stuff. Also, I've uh, pretty much bred all the cows that I need to at this point. <laughs> Got so many cows. Uh, but yeah, so what I want to do is go down through here and uh, yeah, just sort of connect up the two areas. Shouldn't be that hard, like I said. And um, yeah, so this is where I'm going to be next. So uh, I'll see you in just a moment when I kind of have things opened up a little bit. Okay, so I've, uh, I have linked it up. Um, although I've ran into a slight problem that I'm going to be making a very aggressive fix for. 
Um, oops, I just want to put these blocks away. Prep the clear inventory. So this, uh, I knew this didn't line up perfectly, but I thought they were further apart. So this is going to be like my duct tape fix for it. Uh, well, kind of a less duct tape, but like a permanent fix for it. Because a duct tape fix would have just been like, oh, I'll have a weird shaped hallway. Instead, my fix is going to be, um... I'm just gonna I'm just gonna extend this room forward. I'm just gonna push it forward like five blocks or the, it's actually four blocks that I'm gonna be pushing it forward, but like yeah. It's fine, I guess. I don't know. I'm not I'm not the happiest with this because uh, I'm now going to extend this room. I'm probably just gonna make this room larger. Um but I can't think of that much better of a fix for it. Um, so that's just gonna how, that's just gonna how, that's just gonna how, that's just how it's gonna be. <laughs> Said the same wrong thing like three times. And uh, yeah, just to like make this easier on myself, I'm just gonna extend this uh, through. Um, I was kind of hoping that these hallways were going to be, this hallway was going to be like super long, but it isn't really, I can, I can maybe fix that with just using stairs here, but I don't really want to use stairs. I'd rather use half slabs. I know that kind of, I'm, I'm pretty inconsistent with that, especially with like here being stairs and like over here being half slabs, but meh. This is my base. I get to choose how I do it. Um, so yeah, I thought I would just tell you that I'm gonna be, uh, before it like actually happens, that I will be uh, pushing forward uh, these blocks. Because, you know, if I didn't do that, and then I come back and it's like, oh, okay, I guess that happened. So yeah, I'll be back in a moment. Okay, I've uh, I finished up the next section. I'm actually uh, pretty happy with it. Um, pretty much what I just did was I just pushed everything forward a block. Uh, well, four blocks, I guess. And uh, I also decided to add uh, these little beams in here. I thought it fit quite well. Um, I Okay, which no there we go there's the records um yeah very very happy with it um the only thing is that like maybe um it would be a little better if i had uh What I call it? If I uh, if I had something nice to put in here, I don't really have anything that I want to put in here. So for now, it's just gonna kind of be a little barren. Um, I'm just gonna put this behind there so we don't have to deal with poor lighting. Um, yeah, at this point, uh, I'm pretty happy uh, with a lot of this stuff. Now I just need to. Uh, do this in here and uh, I think at the top of um, I think I want to make another branch going off of this section I don't know why I've got like the idea to just go straight right from here I don't know that seems interesting I probably won't what I think I really want to do though is uh, I want to connect up this section To over here uh, to over here just so then I have a little bit more of a convenient staircase it probably like let out I don't know like somewhere over here and uh, I could put something cool um, maybe I can put something over here on this side that's where the beacon is currently um, but 
this uh, this section is going to get a lot of nice use uh, because currently uh, it's the fastest way to link the farming district, which I guess that's just what I'm calling it now. Um, yeah, it's the quickest way to get from the farming area to uh, my storage system. It doesn't beat the other way by a lot, but there's an actual staircase on this side, so I don't need to use rockets if I don't want to. Uh, which I do think will be very, very nice as uh, needing to use fire rockets every time I want to get up. Well, not every time, but before I had to take a very inconvenient route, which uh, which I do not like very much. So to not need that is pretty nice. Um, I'm going to be removing the nether portal. This nether portal is going bye-bye. Um, it's less of a, I want to remove the portal and more of a, it is a pain in the butt to want to go to the nether. Although one problem is, is I may have screwed myself over with, uh, with the portal placement. I might not be able to fix it. That that's why this clip is extra long. Uh, where did, oh, right, 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 right. I never put everything back. Um, yeah, it, it might, might be too late. I hope it's not. I really hope it's not. But if it is, I'm going to have to live with the fact that, um, I cannot replace the portal and that where it is, is where it is. But if this links up to the nether hub, to the center of the nether hub, doesn't make a new portal, doesn't make a new anything. And it just links up into the middle like I want it to this will be big I'm really I'm really praying here no oh it's so close oh it's so so close now if I go through here I wonder where this will end up I might be like screwing my myself up here okay this ain't even close this is like nowhere near where it should be. I'm assuming this will just link back up to where it is. Yeah. I wonder if maybe it's possible that like I go in like on one side of this portal and it takes me elsewhere. Mm, no, it doesn't look like it. So like the portal would be right here. Like that's not that far. Come on. Why can't it link? Uh, one thing that I could do as well, if if I really wanted to, which I, I mean, maybe I would do. Um, is uh, just like take this and make the uh, the actual hub here, and like make the portal entrance go there. I'm just gonna try and see if it'll link up properly. Okay, I've, uh, I've done some linking, so uh, I'm thinking this is how I'm going to do it. At this point, I'm going to need to swap up how I want to do my nether hub design, but this is working, and uh, I, I feel like I got kind of lucky uh, with the placement of it being right here. Um, so this is how I think I'm going to do it from now on. Um, it's going to be a bit of a pain in the butt, but the time that I'm saving flying around in the overworld I'm gonna be saving or uh, I'm gonna be losing a bit in the, ne the nether but I mean what am I gonna do about it and uh, it also gets rid of the eyesore in the middle and uh, it also makes me feel less bad about using TNT on this because like I wanted to try and keep a little platform in the center uh, so I'm just gonna probably pull the crap out of this thing now um, if you don't know, the design that I wanted to do for this thing was uh, I wanted to do like a little center island where uh, this would be on an island and there would be bridges connecting on all of the uh, the 90 degrees. Um, now I'm not really sure. I might just do the same thing, to be honest, except instead of in the middle, there is a... Uh,
uh, what you might call it. Like I might put like a, a map here that gives you a uh, a little a lexicon of where to go, um, or not a lexicon, uh, like a map, pretty much. Actually, no, just literally a map. <laughs> um, I'm positive that in the future. Um, this nether hub will be redone at some point in the LP series as uh, I did not future proof this nether hub so I'm sure eventually I'll be taking up every single one of these slots in the hub once that happens there's no more uh, there's n there's no more slots there's no adding so when that happens I'm going to be changing the nether hub to being four long hallways of uh, four long ice roads um, that's also another reason why I'm kind of seldom decorating these uh, the uh, the highways because I'm I'm just so positive that one day I'm gonna I'm gonna be replacing them so yeah um, that's going to be it for, for right now, though. Gee, that's just going to be it for this episode. Um, I'm going on a little longer than I would have liked to. Um, and I got a lot done. I really did. This uh, this episode has been, uh, been a pretty eventful one for me. As um, I've done a couple of episodes in the past where I kind of, you know, go, go through the base and do a little cleanup. But I don't think I've ever done it on this level. Where I had three major things that I got done. The big tree. This room's decorated. Um, the link between the farming area and this area, as well as a new portal link. So, tons done on this episode. Really, really happy with it. So, yeah. I think that's going to be uh, that's gonna be where I uh, leave off for today. Um... In my, in my ever leaning uh, inspiration from Mr. Slab, um, I'm, I'm thinking about on episode 50 of the LP here, uh, I'm thinking about doing a world tour uh, and making it every 50 episodes I do a world tour. Um, so I'm definitely going to do another cleanup episode because I really want the world looking pretty for the world tour. Um, as, you know, I, I'm, I definitely have more than enough builds for a world tour at this point. Um, and yeah, so anyway, that's gonna be it for this episode. I'll, uh, see you all next time. So adios. Bye-bye.